And finally, for singing, <coughs> sing doctrinally pure songs. There's no excuse for teaching your children the Reformed faith and then singing Arminian songs that defeat their purpose. And then don't forget to sing the Psalms. The Psalms are so God-centered. Calvin said they're an anatomy of all parts of the soul. They are a rich gold mine for deep, reformed, confessional, experiential, and practical living and promoting what Calvin called pietas, genuine piety. And teach your children to sing heartily and with feeling. Whatsoever you do, do it heartily as to the Lord and not as unto men, Colossians 3 says. Now, after family worship, when you go to bed at night, I would suggest that you get down on your knees with your wife every night and you pray together, just the two of you, and you take turns. We've been doing that for 30 some years and it's, I'll tell you, it's wonderful. I love to hear my wife pray. And in that prayer, you often say to the Lord something like this, Lord, bless our feeble efforts today in family worship to the eternal gain of our children and help us to grow in the ability to do family worship. 